Well, in 2014, U.S. farmers produced 1.3 billion pounds of pumpkins. And since Halloween is right around the corner, you might be thinking about going to buy one or two for yourself. Taylor Fry now joins us for this week's Ag Minute. And Taylor, you tell me that there's a lot more that you yes. can do with pumpkins besides just decorating. Mm -hmm. And one of my favorite memories growing up is when my siblings and I would carve pumpkins. It was so much fun. But there's a lot more you can do with the pumpkin than just carving it. They're quite delicious and nutritious, too. The Ag Minute on This Week in Louisiana Agriculture is brought to you by your Louisiana propane dealers. Fuel for our future. It's the season of everything pumpkin. Pumpkin pie, pumpkin spice lattes, pumpkin scrub, pumpkin candles, you name it, it probably comes in pumpkin. Well, did you know pumpkins originated in Central America and now grow on six continents? They've been growing in North America for 5,000 years and are indigenous to the Western Hemisphere. The kind of pumpkins you probably carve at home are called Connecticut field pumpkins. Louisiana farmers have a hard time growing that variety because of humidity. However, there are 30 varieties of pumpkins and some of them do grow well here in Louisiana. Pumpkins are quite nutritious too. A serving of pumpkin only has about 0.5 grams of fat. Pumpkins are also really good for cooking. There's a lot of recipes to try in the kitchen like pumpkin butter, pumpkin smoothies, pumpkin fries, or even pumpkin puree, just to name a few. And here's a fun fact. The largest pumpkin pie ever baked weighed 3,699 pounds. All it took was about 1,200 pounds of canned pumpkins. Now moving on to this week's Twilight Trivia. Last week's question was, what state produces the most popcorn? And the correct answer is B, Nebraska. This week's question is, how long does it typically take to grow a pumpkin? Is it A, 30 to 60 days, B, 60 to 90 days, or C, 90 to 120 days? To enter this week's Twilight Trivia Contest, just log on to your Facebook or Twitter account and post your answer with the hashtag Twilight Trivia, or you can always submit your answer on our website at twilighttv.org. And coming up, see what's burning up on social media this week, and Neil Malasson brings us some sweet news on a trip deal. Stay with us.